Hello everybody and welcome to my channel. In this video I'll be showing you how to make a graduation hat cake. Okay you guys, so the first step I'm gonna do is to actually color my fondant. Now these cakes can take other colors, like for instance this fondant hat cake, it could be all black, but today I'm gonna make it into like this very dark blue to a blackish color, if you know what I mean. So that's what I'm gonna start to do. I have here my white fondant. I'm gonna use some Wilton blue, sky blue fondant. And here I've got the black fondant to mix it in with a blue dark fondant to make the color I'm looking for. So let's get started. Okay guys, so I've got my white fondant here. I'm just gonna put some powdered sugar or cornstarch. Here I've got a mix of two. So the fondant doesn't stick. I'm just gonna take some of this blue fondant. I'm, I'm gonna use a lot of that right now because I need a very dark color. I'm just gonna start kneading the color to, till it's uniform. Okay guys, after I've got almost a uniform color of blue here, I'm just gonna take some of my pre-made black fondant. This is store-bought, I didn't make it on my own. I'm just gonna cut a piece of this, add it here, and start kneading. Okay, here you guys, I have colored my fondant to the desired color. Now I'm just gonna take my cake pan, a piece of cardboard, a ruler and a pen to know the square that's going to be on top of the hat, the one that's on top, how much we're going to need. So this is the cake. I would need almost this much. So I mark where I need it. I take my ruler and I draw the lines just like that. That's how I'm going to need. I'm just gonna cut it right now and I'm gonna cover it with fondant. Okay guys, I have cut my desired shape. Now I'm just gonna spread some icing here. I'm just gonna use buttercream to so the fondant can adhere to this and I'm gonna use it as the top of the hat. So I'm just gonna start by putting some buttercream here. Okay guys, once we have covered the top with the buttercream, now I'm just going to cover it with fondant. So here I've got some powdered sugar, I'm going to put on my bench here. I'm just going to start rolling this fondant. You want to roll it pretty thinly. Okay guys, now going down to the part where we make the ribbon, the thing that dupes down the hat, here, I've got my gold color fondant, I'm just going to put some powdered sugar here, I'm going to roll it, I'm going to save the piece, I'm going to roll this, here we've got our rolled out gold fondant, now I'm just going to trim the sides, Like 
separate them. Okay, once I finished making the strips, I just curled it all together to make this shape. Okay guys, so here I pre-made a fondant cake, that's a cake that has been covered with fondant. If you are wondering how to make that, please watch my video of how to cover a cake with fondant tutorial. I, we've made the cap here at the top, and we've made this gold thing that drapes down the middle. All there is left to do now is to assemble it. So here on my cake, I'm just going to put some icing here, just to hold this in place. Just like this. Now I'm going to start making a border down the middle. this on with some icing here just like this okay you guys so here's the finch cake i hope you enjoyed watching this video please 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 subscribe to my channel and comment down what you think of this video like my video and please visit my facebook page at www.facebook.com slash dessert 101 have a nice day Okay guys, here is the 100% finished cake, the graduation hat cake, I hope you enjoyed this video. Now I'm just gonna cut this cake for you to see it on the inside too. Okay, now to cut this cake, I'm just gonna take the top off, because this is non-edible as we said. This is Actually, this is edible, this one. And now I'm gonna cut it. Here is the cake.